It's the Oscars. Everybody's laughing and having a great time. And Chris Rock's on stage and he's making jokes about all the people in the crowd and poking fun out of them. And Will Smith's there. He's smiling and having himself a grand time. And then Chris Rock's going to make a joke about Will Smith's wife, Jada. Jada, I love you. G.I. Jane 2. Can't wait to see it. All right? And if you don't know what that joke is, G.I. Jane's a movie with Demi Moore where she had to shave her head, buzz cut, and Jada Smith has recently come open to the public about her struggles with hair loss and alopecia. Man, at this point, I can only laugh. Now, y'all know I've been struggling with alopecia. And- so at this point, she can only laugh. She's been struggling with it. She came out. It's a big deal. And uh, so let's let's hear the joke again. G.I. Jane 2, can't wait to see it. All right? And Will Smith accidentally finds it hilarious. Just big old open mouth laugh, head chuckle galore. One more time. G.I. Jane 2, can't wait to see it. All right? Will's laughing it up. Uh Uh-oh. Jada does not like the joke. She stares some daggers Chris Rock's way. Sometime right after this scene, she's going to turn to Will, give him the same look, and that's going to change the way this goes. (laughs) That That was a nice one. Okay. That was a nice one. Okay, forget about it. Let's just move on and let's let this die. I'm out here. Uh Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Richard. (laughs) Oh, wow. (laughs) So at this point, everyone's like, is that real? Is that fake? What the hell was that? Wow. Will Smith just smacked the shit out of me. Will Smith just smacked the shit out of me. I like Will Smith's style here because I feel like this is a slap that he learned on a movie set somewhere because he really sticks it. So he goes palm out, and then he really follows through like Karate Kid. Like, that just doesn't seem like a normal slap. It seems like a movie set taught him that full-body twist, and Chris Rock just eats it. I tried to zoom in because it still seems fake at this point, but it wasn't a punch. It was a slap. And Chris Rock just eats it. And he's like, what the hell? People are still kind of laughing in the background like, uh, what the hell's going on? Wow, dude. Wow, dude is the (laughs) ultimate response when someone (laughs) overreacts to a joke. That's pretty universal. That's probably been going on for 60 years. Wow, dude. Really? Yeah. It was a G.I. Jane joke. Keep my wife's name out your fucking mouth. I'm going to, okay? I'm going to. I don't want to be involved with you in any way anymore. We're good. And the whole audience goes silent now because it's like, oh, my God. (laughs) Oh, I could. Oh, okay. I think he's saying there, oh, I could. And I'm like, what could you do? (laughs) <laughs> oh, I could do it. Whatever you could do. That was a uh, greatest night in the history of television. Okay. Okay. So we are here to uh, give a documentary out. To, ah, to give an Oscar. To give an Oscar out. That's the only flaw in the whole thing from Chris Rock. Everything else he did was amazing. If he would have nailed the next line, it would have been great. But he's not here to give a documentary out. That would be weird unless he's a producer somewhere. I just want to show you that after the punch, as far as we can see, Chris Rock never touches his face, never rubs it, never nothing. So, I mean, he comes out the big winner if this is real. I also love this look behind stage. Like, we're just going to, you guys aren't going to stop or anything. We're just going (laughs) to, right. Uh, Yeah, you want me to just stay up here and do the presentation as I had planned? Give the documentary out. All right. Sounds good. 